watching Louisiana Living with Ashley Doughty on Fox 14. And welcome back. I'm here with Edna Matthews with our tip to be encouraged. Edna, thank you so much for being here as always. Thank you. Yeah, this is going to be a rainy weekend, so it may be a good weekend to sort of reflect. Well, you know what? And it would be a good weekend for couples, too, mm -hmm. to really look at, you know, how do we create this sustainable, loving relationship? And so yeah. I thought we'd have a few tips about that because that's been one of the things that I've been doing some uh, life skills discussions about this week with others and, and should I say counseling with others. So mm -hmm. I just thought I'd share some of the tips that I'd already composed. Wonderful. And, and uh, you know, the reality of it all is, is that relationships do hit milestones and we all know that. And uh, so it's so important to have some uh, plans in place to sustain that relationship and so one of the things is to have space have your own space you know in relationships so, so often sometimes couples think that it's important because we're couples to do everything together it's important to have some individual space some time just to go to the gym by yourself some time just to uh, read a book uh, some time just to hang out with your friends mm -hmm. and uh, then to choose your best battles. You know, it's, it's important not to have to win every battle in the relationship or even to have it turn into a battle. But choose your battles because the goal is not so much to win but as to resolve whatever the problem is. And uh, the other thing to do that is so important then to know how to keep the communications open. Uh, oftentimes when we get into the relationship and have been into the relationship for a period of time, you know, we think, well, you know what I'm thinking or, or, or I know what you're thinking. The reality of it all is, is that communications is key. We have to be able to talk with each other and then we can truly understand not only what we're thinking but what we're feeling too. And then go out on dates, Ashley. Uh, you know, this is one of the first things that go missing a lot of times with couples. You know, don't get lazy. Don't take for granted. Go out on dates and have some exciting time and, and some enjoyable time. Do something different. Don't do the same old things that you always did, which ultimately becomes boring. Um, sure. And, and then be sure not to try to be the problem solver. And this is important for men uh, to hear, and, and women too, but oftentimes, you know, when the mate comes and, and has a problem or a challenge that's going on in her life, you know, men are naturally tend to want to solve the problem. And so it's so important just to be a good listener and to be a good supporter. And because this is a person coming telling you something that they, because they really trust you and they feel secure and safe with you. So don't try to solve the problem. Just be a good listener and to also realize that uh, if you become their problem solver you then stop being their partner so what, what you want to be are both good partners to each other uh, and then uh, I, I know that we're gonna run out of time we uh, still have a minute left okay uh, so have a goal each member in the, in, the, in the unit needs to have a goal. This really helps each individual to establish their importance and, and to know where their directions are. We don't both have to be accountants. You know, just have your goal and she has her goal and in terms, and then, you know, as a goal, as a relationship, you can come up with those one, two, three foundations that you want to build your relationship off of. And then have lots of laughter. You know, mm -hmm. laughter is key. Create those moments where you can look back on and you can laugh, 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 laugh. And most importantly, last of all, I, I think it's so important to have trust. If we don't have trust, all of the above really didn't matter. So really the, build that foundation. Absolutely. Very great advice. Thank you so much, Edna, for joining us. And have a great weekend. It's Thank great you, Ashley. You. Thank you. Coming up next, we'll be telling you about bulls, bands, and barrels wow. coming up this weekend at the Ike. And we're going to be joined by a rodeo clown. So stay with us. Total bummer. My little car got hit by a Hummer. Cars totaled. I'm hurt. I'm broke.